Oh, we're in for a treat this morning. Yeah. Welcome back to today. Uh, we've got a great Southern meal this morning in Today Food. This is Chef Lazarus Lynch. Remember that name? He's sharing the secrets of this, this spicy buttermilk fried chicken recipe, along with some other mouth-watering classics as well. So good to see you. So good to see you, Craig. Thank you for coming in. I'm honored to be here. Let's, let's start with a spicy chicken sandwich. First of all, what goes into it? So we're going to start off our chicken by creating the bath for our thighs. So we've got some eggs that are cracked this bowl, two large eggs. I actually want you to give that a whisk for me, okay, if absolutely. you don't mind. Now we're gonna also use some buttermilk because after all, it is a buttermilk fried chicken sandwich. The what? buttermilk is also going to tenderize our chicken. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna use our favorite kind of hot sauce, whatever you like. It feels like uh, spicy chicken or hot chicken is all the rage right now. It is. It's very ubiquitous, but mine is a little different, and I'll show you why. Is we're using good? a seasoning blend. That's ones? excellent. I'm gonna add the seasoning mix in here. You can see up here we have our seasoning blend and uh, we just add a little bit inside there. So now we're gonna add our chicken pieces. Hello, chicken thighs. <laughs> and why the thigh? Yo, yo. Why, why not? So this is a boneless chicken thigh. I'm okay. using skin on, you can also use skin off. We're using it because it's a dark meat and okay. because it's actually very tender. You can also do this with chicken breast. Okay. Um, but I love the thigh. We like dark meat in my family. How, <laughs> how, how long are we gonna keep it in okay, the fridge? Okay, so that gets covered for about 30 minutes okay. and then all the way to overnight. Okay? okay, easy. So we have some that's been marinating already overnight. And uh, what we're going to do now is create the dredge. So this is some all-purpose flour, cornstarch, and baking powder. All three? All three. Now here's the thing. This cornstarch will actually create, and the, and the baking powder, will create this really nice crisp texture on our chicken. Okay, now what I want you to do mm -hmm. is add about two ladles of some of our liquid marinade. To the dredging? To the dredging. Oh. Okay. There's one. And I also added my seasoning mix. Now what this will do is create... What's in the lumps. seasoning mix? And notice how fast you went there. All right. I added my seasoning mix. <laughs> my seasoning mix. It just, it just flew you know, right by that. Paprika. Uh -huh. it's, all, it's all that good sure, stuff. So sure. we're going to take our chicken here. Okay. It's been marinating. Mm. we got some cayenne pepper in there, too. Some more pepper. Oh, yeah, baby. So good. <laughs> so we, loving it. Oh, we, yeah. When we drop it in the pan there, how hot should the pan so be? So the oil should go to about 360 degrees. Okay. Uh, really no more than that. I'm using a cast iron skillet because, you know, in the south, that's what we do. That. So that gets fried. How long? It's a little messy. So about 10 minutes total. Okay. I finish it in the oven. Finish it in the I oven? I do finish Why it in the that? oven. Well, we just want color on the outside. Okay. We don't want to overcook it. Gotcha. Okay, so we finish that in the oven. We have some that are prepared right here. Let's take a walk to the front, oh, Craig. This you go looks beautiful. Me. This Thank looks you. beautiful. Can I just touch you? Maybe your you skills will rub off. This is the best chicken I've ever is tasted. No, ever? Like, oh, ever. Yeah. That's a Spices. bold statement. That is a huge statement. In my 38 years of living, this is the best chicken oh, I've ever tasted. Whoa. I'm not kidding. Put it on your I website. No, I, I love I'm not kidding. In addition <laughs> to the spicy amazing. chicken sandwich, we've also got some sweet potato fries and... We yeah. do. So we've got our, our bread. We're going to assemble it right now. Okay. we got our mayonnaise mix. Here, just take some mayonnaise. Use that. I'm going to steal... This right on lather your here lather your bun. You got oh, right got my, oh, you got your own. Lather your bun. You got lather your it. Lather your bun. Lather your bun. I'm a mayo lover, so go for it. You know? oh, who are you kidding? <laughs> Oh America's goodness. best condiment, right? Or favorite condiment? I agree. You got some lettuce, some yeah, tomatoes, so you got some and lettuce, you got red cabbage. Some tomatoes, some Does red the order cabbage. matter? All of this is optional. You okay. do whatever you want. I like lettuce, tomato, cabbage. Oh my God. You know, this is fun food. This is brunch food. I call it solicious food. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just, it speaks to your soul, it speaks to my heart. Definitely, look, I've got this upside down. That's a beautiful Who cares? sandwich. And we're pairing this with some sweet potato fries. We don't even have time to get to the fries. <laughs> and that's your dad's cobbler? peach cobbler? Yeah. It's my grandmother's peach cobbler. Stop. My dad it, it inherited it, and then I inherited the recipe. You're welcome here anytime. Thank you so much. The uh, recipes are going to be on today.com backslash food. Uh, Lazarus Lynch, a big thanks to you, and a big thanks to you as well. That's going to do it for this Saturday morning. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there, and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.